This is your first electric guitar lesson using a pick. You want to hold it in the middle. You don't want to be too far back. You want to be kind of in the middle so there's just a little bit sticking off the top there. And first we're just going to learn the strings. So we have our E string, your low E string. And you start by picking it all down strokes. Down, down, down. On a tab, just playing the open E string like this is represented as a zero. So we're going to play down strokes. Now try some up strokes. Just up strokes. And now try down up strokes. Down, up, down, up. Down up strokes are called alternate picking. So we have down, up, down, up. Now we're going to move on to the next string here. This is your A string. Same thing here. Down strokes, up strokes, alternate picking. Down, up. Now we're on to the D string here. So we have E, A, D. Make sure your guitar is in tune. Your string should sound like this. There's a tuning video you can check out if it doesn't sound quite in tune to my guitar here, which is in E standard tuning. E, A, D. Now we're on to the G. Next is the B string. And finally, the high E string, little e. Again, we have E, A, D, G, B, E. Now, the next thing we're going to learn is just a few quick notes on some of the strings here. We have, usually on most guitars, there's a dot or some kind of a marker on the third fret here. So just playing the E string, we'll go to the third fret on the E string. That's a G note there. The fifth fret also has a marker. That's an A note. G, A. Seventh fret is a B. G, A, B. Along the E string there. On the A string here, at the third fret, we have a C. Fifth fret, we have D. Seventh fret, we have E. And this is a higher up version of the low E. So we have low E, high E. Two of the same notes, just an octave apart. So again, G, A, B, C, D, E. And you can see now when you're pushing down on the string, that's a three on the tab, five, seven on the E string, three, five, seven on the A string. Now we're going to go all the way up to the 12th fret. Now some guitars have two dots at the 12th fret. That basically means is we're going zero is an open string, first fret, second, three, five, seven, eight, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now the 12th fret again, there's 12 notes in music, and this is where our octave starts again. So we have a low E note, and at the 12th fret, we have E octave, another E note. Same note, just a difference in pitch there. Same with the A string at the 12th fret, two A notes. D string. G, B, high E. And now for your first lesson, we're going to learn that intro that's played at the start of this video. So we're starting here at the 12th fret and of the high E string, and that's your high E note. I'm going to pick it with a down stroke, down, let go, up, down, up. So a group of four. One, two, three, four, but only on the one do we play the 12th fret. So one, then three open strings. 
One, two, three, four. And the pick's going down up like that, right? Alternate picking. One, two, three, four. Get used to playing that for a bit. You can also try this on all the other strings, the B, G, D. But going back down to uh, the 12th fret here on the E, we'll play that once. And now we're going to move it down to the 7th fret. So we went from 12 to 7. And while you're picking the open strings is when you can sort of move your finger there. So we're going to go to 5 next. Then 3. So 12, 7, 5, 3, 2, back up, 3, 5, 7, 12. And it's just a matter now of playing that a little bit faster once you get used to picking down up. the other strings. Remember though these are just groups of four and the speed will come once you get to master this slowly. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now we can also play this in groups of three. So instead of one, two, three, four, it's gonna be one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So every time I say one, we're gonna pick this, you know, we're gonna fret the note at the 12th fret. One, two, three. The difference is now, when I do the one again, it's on an upstroke. So it's on down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Same pattern, seventh fret, fifth fret, third fret, second fret. Groups of three. You could also do groups of two. One, two, one, two, one, two. 12th fret, 7th fret, 5th fret, 3rd fret. On all the other strings. Now that's a bit more of an advanced pattern, what I'm doing there is, I'll go back to groups of 4 again. Once you've mastered this little part here, we can add some variety to it. So we'll go to 12th fret, 1, 2, 3, 4, 7th fret, 8th fret, 5th fret, 7th fret, 3rd fret, 5th fret, 2nd fret. Twelve, seven, eight, five, seven, three, five, two is the pattern this time. And then you know we can play this in triplets. Uh, let's go to the D string here. One, two, three. So this lesson's all good for working your alternate picking skills, picking individual notes, playing something that sounds pretty cool and just getting your speed up. So, you know, don't worry about the speed in the beginning, just worry about accuracy. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And again, this sounds pretty cool when you add some distortion to the mix. Gives it more of a heavy metal sound like this.